spit out the problem. Why? Okay. Now, do not interrupt. Spit out the duct, problem. Duct tape the fucking lips. All right. I need. I need a length of time to explain myself without you flapping your gums. Well, half of these Instagram people have already scrolled by. Fine. Okay. Why does he find it necessary to repeat himself ten thousand times? He'll read. He'll say the same thing over and over and over. Like by the first, we'll say half a dozen, six times. Yes, dear. Yes, dear. Yes, dear. Yes, dear. Yes, dear. I answer him at least six times, but then I don't answer him for the next a hundred and twenty times. Right? And then I get labeled, I'm ignoring him or I'm not responding. I fucking responded 20 times, you just don't listen. It's very fucking simple. Number one, you chose to jump on board with somebody who is a repetitive machine. The only reason I'm fucking good, good in some instances. only reason I'm fucking good at what I'm fucking good at is because I can repeat the same process over and over and over. Now, I wasn't that fucking bright as a youngster. Sometimes it's good. But I learned to fucking work hard. And more importantly, I learned to repeat shit. And a lot of times when I'm repeating shit, it's because that's part of what I need to become one with the process. Now, sometimes it's really helpful. Sometimes it's really fucking hurtful. You know? I mean, Jesus Christ, when you can learn to, you, when you can find comfort in doing the same things over and over, like as a little boy, you find out where your dick is and you find it feels really fucking good to rub it. You rub that <laughs> motherfucker and you won't stop fucking rubbing, you know? I mean, remember when you're like in fifth grade? Well, at least when I was in fifth grade, they had the fucking little shorts that were made of this really fucking silky material and they had the goddamn inserts and the shorts were in there so you didn't need to wear underwear. Well, just putting those things on, you fucking sprouted a little fucking boner. And then all you could, thinking about you could just fucking brush it up against something. It was so smooth and so silky. Next thing you know, you know, you're just fucking hidden in a corner of your room, just fucking rubbing that thing like a motherfucker. And your mom's like, John, it's time for soccer practice. Hurry up, get down here. Just one minute, mom. As you're just fucking crump. Well, see, that's one of those times where repeating the same process could be arguably good or bad. I suppose it really depends on which side of the fence you want to argue. But <laughs> now getting to more of the actual adult reality of this, all of these processes that I've learned to repeat over and over have made me really fucking good at what I choose to do. But this one. You're missing the point. This one. You're my daughters. Repetitive. And just be quiet as I get to it. My daughters and this one. They start to realize that this repetitive process that gives us, you know, this fucking great life also becomes a major fucking hindrance when I say the same shit to them. It's got fucking over cotton balls and in his over ears. And over and over. For those that I coach, you guys, I've all told you, my daughters fucking love it, but it makes me a fucking great coach because I love to repeat myself. <clears throat> well, I think he likes to listen to himself. I was say, that's probably part of the deal. <laughs> but the bottom line is, I am an OCD motherfucker, and I have learned to use that to my advantage. Totally now, when I repeat things over and over, that's just one of those fucking loops that happens in part of the process, and unfortunately, you're just caught up in the fucking negative side effect of the loops happening over and over, because the positive loops get us everything we want. Okay. And there you have it's it. It's a two-part, though. But, but if you do... You repeat shit over and over and you don't hear a fucking word I say. Well, think about how well that works in the fucking sack. Huh? I have no complaints in the sack. Well, you can say what you want in the sack, but I'm doing what I want in the sack, which means you don't have Luckily, any complaints. Luckily, 90% of the time so, it benefits me. So, <laughs> again, you know, you can talk about the good no. or the bad side of this. The bottom fucking no. line is... This repetitive thing that happens over and over, even me repeating myself. I don't like to can be work labeled for you or as against you. Disgruntled or I, I, ignoring you or not respond. You're, are you going to respond? Like I responded 10 fucking times. What do you want me to do? I respond to myself 10 times and I'll still fucking say it again. You should hear what goes on in my head, let alone what happens I'm outside. I'm going to record it. I'm just going to hit a button and just play it back to him over and over. 
the bottom line is another fucking problem it's really not a fucking problem coming out of this spoiled fucking rotten little lady over here I am not rotten I am a I'm a good wife you do what you're told yes you do <laughs> but apparently I I'm I'm what's the word you used obedient Disobedient. <laughs> <laughs> fucking dog <laughs> No, just open your ears, fucking listen. I answer. No, what I tell he her. He says that my answers I, are in my head. They don't I actually come this. out of my mouth. I tell her Such this. bullshit. It's very simple. Our relationship works on one simple premise. Hurry up and agree with me so I can give you what you want. Do you know how many times I've heard that? It's such bullshit. It's not but bullshit. it's true. It's not, it's not it's bullshit. It's bullshit. No, it's an actual fact. That's not I have to like whisper in his ear while he's sleeping, like subliminally put messages into that little nugget of his. You know, he'll listen to save his life. That's a good thing. If I listened to what society said, you wouldn't be having these fucking complaints. I'm about, not society, about, I'm your other half. How to use the fucking which barbecue at which house or fucking how to clean toilets at which fucking house. So, do you know why he's reaching with that whole barbecue thing? Because he has nothing to complain about. Nothing. No, I, I spoil his ass. Yes. And so when the steak is not cold in the middle, she has an excuse. Why? Because I like my <laughs> shit rare. <laughs> well, <if> I... <laughs> All right, he my had pitch. his opportunity to dig on me the other day, and he chose not to. I think he's making up for it. Well, it's easier. I have much easier time digging on you once you take a shot at me. So... Anyway, talking, my peeps. Tuck the hind legs off the horse with cotton balls in his ears. Damn it. Do whatever the fuck you want. But the bottom line is, we're over here getting it done. Getting it done, babe. Rock and roll, my peeps. Making a fucking killer. Killer day.